Hello, Stephen, and welcome to Pallo TV. Uh, thank you for having me. Yeah, you're now 35 years of age and still seems to be going strong and scoring goals. What's your secret? Uh, I don't know, to be honest. It's just normal keeping the body in shape, keeping fit, keeping motivated. And just that's, that's it. Yeah. You played most of your professional career in Vasan Palloseura over 10 years. Um, what was it that made you stay in Vasa? I'm sure you have offers along the road. Yeah, I think I have a lot of offers on the road, but I have to be loyal to a club that has been loyal to me. And, you know, the opportunity to come to leave a couple of times, but when you have love from the city and they show you support on and off the pitch, it gives you much pleasure to actually stay and continue with the club. Yeah. How would you rate uh, VPS season so far? It seems as if you have adapted to the Cause League just fine. I think we have adapted fine and I think we had a lot of players who haven't played Vegas Liga so much so we had a lot of motivated players to play. I think me, Strandval and Aspi Farsman are more the more senior players who have played a lot of Vegas Liga games. And I think it's the motivation from the guys who haven't played Vegas Liga for the first time. I think that's one of the push plus we as the senior guys who are with the experience of playing helping also. Yeah, well, even though they haven't played Vegas Liga games, you have a fairly uh, uh, experienced crew. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're not young boys. No, uh, they're I, not I, young I, boys, but, yeah. you know, they're fairly experienced. I think Kale Mutinen also, Ali Pakosel are fairly experienced in Finland playing. And I think that's one of the, the key to our season with experienced guys in the club also playing with a couple of young players who have showed really good talent. Yeah, that was my next question. Uh, how, how important do you think that experience is in this case? I mean, as VPS, as an, as an underdog, so to speak. It's it's quite important. I think it's quite important just to keep the, the, the unexperienced players humble, humbled in the games that we do win. Even if we're still winning, we still keep humble, still pushing. And uh, to have experience in the team, just to show the guys how you do things when when it's time to be professional, ex example and day off and things like that, what to eat and I think how to prepare for games and things like that, it does show and I think most of the young players know how to say are adapting really well, especially I think Samba Silla, I just tell him before, good like, good that you asked me this question, see him start to you know, prepare a bit better for games and you know try to be more professional. And it's, as an experienced player, it's nice to see when the young guys adapt to trying to keep healthy and trying to do the right things when it's time to keep focus, you know? Yeah. What would you say that you still have to improve in order to avoid problems comes fall? Mm, uh, personal or team-wise? Team-wise. Teams, I think we have to improve, I think, in the defending because you see where I think we have maybe the most goals in the league also. So if we improve and keep in clean sheet like we did today, I think we have a fair chance to finish in top part of the table. Yeah. Okay, let's go forward. Uh, next week you're up against Maria Hamina IFK at home. What is to be expected from that game? Oh, it's last last game was a level one was really tough, and I think there's no easy Vegas Liga games. It's all it's it get easy when we do score goals and like today they had a red card. I think it's going to be a really tough game. Every game in Vegas Liga is tough games. Because on any given day, any team can beat any team. We see Olo beat Oiko the other day. And we see also the cup games are going. So in this league and Finland, it's not easy, no team to, to beat them. Thank you, Morrissey. And good luck with the future. Uh, thank you very thank much. You. No problem.